you're insane, Walt. Uh, why'd you have to pick me? That's what I want now. <laughs> that are so scratched up I can't see through them. Tonight I've got my new ones on. They look a lot more distinguished, Dr. Mark says, when I'm eating donuts in these glasses. I also picked the wrong day last week to wear a tank top here to WDER with the tag sticking up out of the back. And, uh, <laughs> yep, still got that problem tonight. Last week was definitely the wrong, I picked the wrong day to, uh, allow Tom Wodok, host of Common Thread on WDVRFM, to be in front of me and around me with a camera in his hand, like he's doing again tonight. <laughs> I don't know if you were tuned in last week to find out that, uh, is this true, Jeff, that he uh, actually put me on? It's TV? absolutely true. There's over 72 views last time I heard. 72 Seven, people in oh, the world have seen you on YouTube. <laughs> This is so ridiculous. Modoc, you're insane, okay? You're just totally insane. I have no idea why he did that. It came out pretty well, though. It came out pretty well? Yeah. I don't right. think you'll be disappointed. Well, I saw Joy was watching it, my bride, who was actually downstairs with a few other guests tonight, and um, they'll be up in a bit. She had it on Saturday morning, she watched it, and then she called me in and started it, and mm -hmm. I took one look at myself and left the room. And then Saturday night, my oldest son, Bill, and my outlaw daughter, Danielle, had it on. And I said, oh, come on. <laughs> look at it. Grab my grandson and said, come on, Logan. <laughs> We're going to go have some fun. But if it makes you feel any better, um, uh -huh. one of the comments did include uh, something about the cameraman and made him dizzy. They said, oh, no, really? the camera work made them dizzy. Did they leave comments on this thing? They leave comments. There's nothing negative about either of us, but there was one negative comment about the cameraman who happened to jiggle the camera a little too much. That's him. That's him. So, okay, so wait a minute now. People are leaving comments. This is on, uh, what is it called? iTube? YouTube. U Upod? U <laughs> it's on the, you can, and you can view this in the outer net or inner banks. What's it called? Uh, something in between. Okay, yeah. somewhere in between, that's for sure. <laughs> anyway, I'm Jethro, and this is Free Wheeling on WDVR, and the greatest radio station anywhere. Um, <laughs> If you'd like to get a hold of us down here, the phone number is 609-397-1620, extension 5. Or you can shoot us an email, host at wdbrfm.org. And if you want to see my silly face with the tag sticking up again in the back of my tank top, well, feel free to go to the boot tube or whatever that thing is called. Well, <laughs> you're not adding this one to the YouTube, are you? Yeah, except for that thing. Wait, can't you at least... Can you wait until my guests come up at least and maybe sure. get them in there? Sure. I've got some great guests coming up tonight. Bring them up. The special edition. Well, see, now, what, see, one thing Wodok has mentioned to me since I was on early in the morning, actually, four to six down here, he always mentioned to me that, uh, not always, but quite a few times, he's mentioned that I have a Bob Dylan song to fit any occasion or situation. Which isn't really true. I don't doubt that. I mean, Bob Dylan has a song that fits the situation. Okay. I just like warp it around in my own mind to make it fit a certain situation. So of course, when I find out that this video Wodok took last week of me was showing up on this Bluetooth thing or whatever it's called, what came to mind? The Bob Dylan song where he happens to mention Cecil B. DeMille, which is a song I'm starting out with tonight. But the thing that Wodok doesn't realize is that for me, paybacks are a lot of fun. And so he never knows when I'm going to get him back or anything. And the way I actually get people back is I become friends with them, and then mm -hmm. they have to put up with me until they're on their tombstone. 
All right, blow dog, kill it. <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, thank you.